Hey guys, Chris one Theo here. I'm going to give you an overview of the Holiday DLC and the December patch. I'm going to start off with the DLC. First, I'm going to show you how to actually install it. So load up Origin, and then I typed in Holiday into the search bar. Found the Holiday Celebration Pact, and then you just act like you're going to buy it, but it's completely free. You just need to have the Sims 4 base game installed. Moving on to create a sim, this pack gave us three new ugly Christmas sweaters. Yes, they are unisex and are only 14s and over, so for some reason, children didn't get anything. They only gave us three sweaters, so not much, but you know, it's free, so why not? And moving on to build mode, we got the Christmas trees, three holiday garlands, a Christmas tree, a painting, a wall speaker, and two holiday candles. And now, probably my favorite thing is the new snowman. It's just so cute, and I would we're probably in put these in my let's plays, just saying. The last thing in this patch is the new holiday station, and I'm going to give you a snippet of each of the new songs. And that's basically it. So now I'm going to talk about the December patch. The biggest thing they added were two new careers. You got the business and the athletic career. This picture is showing you the different branches and what each level is called. The business requires the logic and charisma skills, while the athletic career, shockingly enough, requires the athletic skill, but also needs the charisma skill. The daily task with the business is to rep file reports so a con computer is basically a must, while the athletic one requires your sim to work out. As of yet, I haven't played in any of these careers, so I don't know much beyond that. But I do know that they give new unlockable objects, like the ones you get in regular careers, once you get promoted. And they also changed it so that some jobs and aspirations require less repetitive action. They also changed things in the user interface, starting with the new icons for the map. They also changed it in-game. You can see your aspiration right off the bat, and the new job menu looks way better. You don't even have to hover over the performance bar to show your daily task. And they also changed the phone, it looks way cooler, and they split it up into four different sections. They also included paid time off and family leave. This is for women in their third trimester, and for men when the child is actually born. And for paid time off, this accumulates whenever your sim goes to work. One of the best things they added is the move object on cheat. Just type in bb.moveobject on and voila! You can basically move anything anywhere. Finally, you guys, we've been waiting and pleading to AA for this forever. You can you move your Christmas tree into the pool if you dang well feel like. Your symbols don't mind, so why should you? One of the final things they added is your when your sim's hygiene gets low enough, like for example through working out. Your sim will get dirt on them. The last thing to note is that they added a button called Randomize from Gallery in Create Sim, so you can click it and a random sim from the gallery will show up, which I think is pretty neat. So that's basically all I had to say. I will post a link to the whole patch notes in the description if you want to read more about them. And other than that, I hope you and your families have a great holiday season. Bye guys!